back with Zipper96 back here for another video for y'all today. Today is that special review that I told y'all, one of them. Um, yeah, I'm going to regret this, but I, I figured just to do it, to get it done and over with before it gets too late in the day. And it gets too hot and it's breezy right now, so if you can't hear me, I apologize. But um, I figured why not do it now, get it done and over with. And I got to try to talk to my mom about helping me pay for my PlayStation Plus. Because that goes out today. Or goes out tonight. I don't know how it goes. I don't know how they do it. I don't know anything about that besides. I just know that it goes out today. It goes out on the 19th. I mean, $25 for three months ain't bad. But anyway. So we're going to get right into the review what are we reviewing today y'all didn't see it until now but because i haven't really showed anybody either on the phone i mean i told Cass, but that's about all i told her of what i bought besides the can of grizzly that my mom bought thursday for me before she left to go tanning what are we reviewing today long horn long cut straight right and everybody knows i hate fucking straight dips straight dips are not good for me i mean i don't mind copenhagen straight but to me it's a little too sweet grizzly uh grizzly straight is um a little bit more s s dumbed down on the sweetness but it was it's it would be more bold like, I, it just, it tastes too straight for me. Um, Timberwolf, I've never had. I thought about that earlier when, after I woke up. I was just like, I don't think I ever had Timberwolf straight. Sorry. I don't have anything in my teeth. But after this review, I'm probably taking this shit right out real fucking quick and putting Grizzly in when I go in. But yeah, we're going to be reviewing Long One Long Cut Straight. Now, some information about this before I get in a look at the can and all that. So, Pinkerton Tobacco Company, or Pinkerton Tobacco Corp. LP, Owensboro, Kentucky, U.S. Con, con, you can call them if you want to. I'm not calling them be a waste of my time sold only in the united states at least 65 percent domestic grown tobacco with snuff longhorn snuff.com 1.2 ounce 34.2 grams so th that's the information if y'all all buy cans of dip y'all would see it it's right there now i'm gonna i'm gonna cover my hand let me cover my face so it can focus on this. I should be able to just touch it and it'll autofocus. I don't know why it, this. I don't know why it's doing that. But yeah, that's the information. I know y'all couldn't see it, but I tried. I give me credit where credit's due. I tried. I don't know, my nose has been bothering me lately. Surprisingly. So look at the can. I give it a uh, six and a half out of 10. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong. I like these cans now like compared to the old cans. But like I said, I don't like fucking straight. I fucking hate it. I don't know why it sounds like a motorcycle just started, but anyway. Anywho. Um, I already did do the coat on the side. I did the coat on the other, the Longhorn Wintergreen can that I did a couple months back or a month back or whatever the case was on the, that video. But yeah, um, look at the can six out. I, well, no, I take that back. I give it a seven out of 10. They actually did really good. But to me, it seems like it's a dark red and then the straight long cut and the SET 2003 
is like a lighter red than the background. But not, I mean, don't get me wrong, it's not a bad can. You got the warning label. Warning, this product can cause mouth cancer. Yeah, well, bullshit. I call bullshit on that. And it says the same thing on the side that it says on the top. Warning, this can can cause mouth cancer. Bullshit. So we're gonna get right into it. You got your dip, grab your dip. If you got your chew, grab your chew. If you don't dip, thumbs up to you. Thank you for coming back to the channel. I know some of y'all don't dip and that's all right, but me, I know I've been talking way too much, but I don't care if it's a long video because I'm trying to change it up a little bit when I do these videos at this point. And I got, I'm probably gonna do a review on Monday. I may get it today because I got to get my mom to get me food and shit before they leave to go somewhere. But um, I may try to get the can of dip today and do the can of dip Monday or Tuesday or Wednesday or next week because I'm going to try to cut the grass on Thursday. Uh, well, back here on probably Friday, but Thursday on the front. But let's get a dip. I don't care if I go over 15 minutes anymore. I really don't. Well, surprisingly, it's moist. It's more, it's more, more. Oh, what the fuck? I guess when they put it together, they, they were like, oh, let's put some outside just in case whoever buys the skin can have fun with it. So, yeah, it, I mean, it, to me, it's moist. Oh, God. That straight smell. I told y'all I fucking hate straight dips. If I don't dip them all. I thought I do not dip straight dips often. I fucking hate it. Oh yeah, by the way, the top is fucking flimsy as shit. I'm I'm barely putting any pressure on it. And look how that thing is bending. See, I barely put in any pressure on it. So you know it's cheapo. They always do cheapos over there at Longhorn and Pinkerton and Timberwolf. By the way, Pinkerton is owned. Pinkerton owns Longhorn and Timberwolf, as far as I know. As far as I know. I don't know anything else. So let's get a dip. Pinchability, five out of 10. It doesn't pinch to save my life. Packability, a four. Taste. Actually, I think I could dip long one straight. I'm not gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie on that. But I don't think I would dip it. Like, I would dip it for my gums more or less than anything. Cause my gums have been receding like a mofo. But yeah, packability, I give it a four. Uh, taste. Gotta give it a few minutes. Would you shut the fuck up and get your motorcycle out of the fucking neighborhood, motherfucker? God damn, wild ass motherfucker, I swear. I swear, people are loud as shit when it comes to that shit. Like their truck, their motorcycle, their car, like, no. You don't need to go ha full ham on your vehicle just to make it sound cool. Be yourself and everybody will like you for you. Like, that's just all I gotta fucking say about it. Anyway, so this has been taken for a few seconds. I, I give the taste about a six, six and a half, surprisingly. But I'm not gonna keep it in much longer, actually, after the view, review. What's the point? Fucking nasty, bro. Like, it, it, it would have probably been worse if I dipped this when I was drinking the other night, but, you know, shit happens. But yeah, I decided to do a little change on the video for y'all for a couple of videos since I've been doing live streams a lot more and it's been in my room and not outside. Uh, I figured why not do a review outside for y'all. Oh yeah, by the way, before I forget, it will be a video up on my second channel later on in the day. Hopefully. I don't know, it depends on how I feel. But yeah, 
Um, just, I don't know, dude. The, uh, see, I have a hatred for straight dips. And the hatred is... I feel like the hatred has grown, grown a little bit more since I put this in. Like, I don't mind straight dips. All, like, it's like me and food. Some food, I got to be in the mood for it. To be able to, you know, eat it. You know, typical me in the mood and the same thing goes for dip I've got to be in the mood for it to be able to want it like yeah don't get me wrong I've been wanting Copenhagen snuff for a while uh, I want grizzly fine cut natural for a while and I'm not gonna lie I've been wanting a straight dip change it up a little bit change up what I dip and give my gums a break but I think I made a really bad decision here. I can dip Grizzly Dark Select all I, all I want, no problem. It's just some some of it, some of the straight dips are not good. Now, Dark Select for Grizzly is basically straight from what I've gathered in searching and information that I found. You don't spit black right away, obviously. You can, huh? You spit a little bit black, not like Grizzly Copenhagen, Timberwolf. Um, kayak, you don't spit black either. You spit brown with that shit. That's just me, though. That's just me. But if, if I had to do a recommendation on dips, and you're a dipper, I if you want. To take a break from your every day, just for a little bit, just for a couple of days, just for a day or two or whatever the case is. I would totally tell you to get Longhorn straight. Give your gums a break. Give your gums time to heal. But also, if y'all don't realize, the thing under, how you get nicotine and sugar into your bloodstream, it goes up under your tongue. It's not because you swallowed it. It's not because... Uh, some dip fell in the back and you accidentally swallowed it. It's none of that. It, it's what's under your tongue is what puts it into your bloodstream. So you don't spit black. You spit like a brownish black. See, I don't have a dip in in the right place. I have it on my left, not my right. I mean, my right, not my left. Shoot. I'm all confused today. And again, I didn't go to bed until... One o'clock, one fifteen ish, something like that, and then I woke up. It was like nine. I woke up at nine, then I woke up again at ten, and I've been up since. I've been up for about an hour. But like I said, I'm probably gonna take this dip out and put Grizzly in after the review. But I don't know. I may let this sit for a while just to get more of an opinion on it later. But. Uh, yeah, I got a review coming out tomorrow, uh, so look out for that review. Um, I'm not going to speak on it. I'm just going to let everybody know that um, I basically have strewn away from Kaz because... Uh, I'm not going to get into it too much, but I'm just going to say that she said something yesterday that really pissed me off. And so we're not together no more. That's all I'm going to say. But um, I might have a live stream tonight. I don't know yet. I haven't decided. Um, honey bird. It's a honey bird drinking water. I don't even think he cares I'm sitting right here. Or they care. Oh, he flew away now. That's the first time I've seen a hummingbird uh, during, during the summer, actually, not gonna lie on that one either. But yeah, um, I'll have a review up tomorrow. Um, so keep your eyes out on that. Um, and I will probably, 
Like I said, I'll probably go live tonight. I don't know. Depends on how I feel. Um, so watch out for the Mars review. That's going to be probably in the morning after I wake up and eat something. I don't know because it depends on if my mom gets me breakfast for tomorrow. Because I don't like cooking. I don't like cooking when she's here unless I'm cooking in the microwave. But look out for them, that review. Keep an eye out for a live stream tonight or tomorrow. Um, if you ain't dipping, you're tripping, keep cracking, keep backing. Over to see you on the dip side. Stay positive. Always think positive and never think negative. Never think we're coming your way. Always think and stay positive and positive things will come in your heart and in your mind. I hope you have a great day, great night wherever you're watching this. And if I don't see you, I'll see you on the dip side. America.